Okay, welcome to a video where I'm showing off this update things. Okay, yeah, this is all the stuff that's at. Okay, so yeah, this is it. See, I added a bunch, a bunch of it, things for the Easter and Pi Day, so it just got spring. Um, there's no jokes in this, and it was April 1st, so it's pretty crazy. But, um, yeah, I don't know what I'm doing. So these are all categorized. This is like the plain, basic egg, of course, if you want. Um, to see all the crafting recipes, go into the bottom of the plane of Minecraft and get that mod, that will help you a lot. And then this is all, and these are all different categories, these, 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 and these. They all have their own different special effects. So, let's go right into it. So, this is a normal one. This should be happening while they're clear. And so then you eat the normal one. Gives you a little bit of health and gives you jump boost. Because it's like an egg, which is from... A bunny or a rabbit so new jump boost so all of them give you one they don't change with that they just change with the effects so that gives you fire resistance too for two minutes all these efforts will give you it for two minutes well I think so then the yellow one gives you it and the orange one gives you it so then we have the pink magenta and purple and these are all just chocolate eggs died dying stuff and then this gives you instant health and that's what, so I can just do like slash uh no slash I should not be doing okay in fact I did it instant minecraft instant damage so then I eat these Okay, well, they they don't have a hundred percent chance to give it to you, but they're it's pretty high, and I'm pretty sure it restores you to full health. And then these are the blue ones. The blue ones give you water breathing. Boom. Drain me. Fully. And then here are the now the green ones are um a little different. The green the two greens and the white one are just like the regular chocolate one. They just give you jump boost. So I guess they're kind of useless because it's just like use ways to die, but yeah, but they all do. There's that. So then also so that's all the egg stuff. But then you can also make nectar. You can take it and it's not that good. It gives you slowness for like a little bit. And then you can also use that to make honey. You can also eat. And it gives you mining fatigue for a little bit. And then you can make honey butter. But, uh, oh yeah, you can't eat actually eat honey butter. It's like a bowl of it. Then you can put down bread with a knife and boom, honey butter bread, which gives you absorption. And so you can like eat that before fight and you just like work all the noobs then we also have mashed potatoes nice gives you resistance which is pretty good and then for pie day we have this and it's, um okay, so let me eat it up so yeah it doesn't give you any effect i don't think i'll check in a second yeah i need to make it real quick cut okay so obviously the name is actually like 3.1 or it is just like a whole bunch of numbers of pie for pie day and it's um things actually have a joke that you have first put a pumpkin pie on the table and you put three point one or it's actually got three point one four and these are all kind of pie ish ingredients and you get the pie and it gives you haste. So yeah, that's the easier update and then now we'll play all the other updates and stuff so you can see what everything does. So yeah, thanks for watching, I'll see you all, or I don't want to see you now, yeah. It's here, it's finally here, the next update to the Food Plus mod. Yes, I did, um, it's Christmas time, um, if you're wondering about the next, but it's a lunch update, I'm only on the texture stage. I have like a plan out stage, and I have a texture stage, then I have the mod stage. The mod stage is going to take like many, many weeks, months, even. I'm only like halfway through the texture. Okay, whatever. Let's get on. This took me a few days. To t I did one day of planning, one day of texturing, and then a few days of coding. I code everything one day, and then like today. 
And I like fixed it because there were a lot of mistakes. Well, there were like no mistakes, but it was being bugged. Whatever. Um, yeah. Where's the dog? So, if you, um, here are all the items, you know. If you want to see the crown recipes, obviously go download the. Like, there are too many recipes in this mod because they're like this. And there's this. And there's this. So I can't cover it all. But there's a mod called Not Enough Items in the description of the page, Planet Minecraft page. There is like a video and the download page because it's a little different to download. I do not own it, it's somebody else's. I think I've already explained this in the video because I'm parent. Yep. Yeah. It's a long story. Whatever, let's just get straight into it. You're the survival button, yes. First off, the peppermint candy. It's okay, it gives you one heart, it gives you strength for two minutes, so that's pretty cool. Slash clear, clear slash effects. Clear. Clear, okay. Oops. Next is like the candy cane. No. That's a festive jump boost. For like a minute for a second. Um all the like the things before have been um they actually not that long of effect it's kind of weird i don't know why it made it so short but whatever so there's a mug that's used crafting there's eggnog this is the biggest fail part of this mod or this update you eat it you don't get the mug back which you're supposed to you you eat it it gives you slowness because you know like you're getting drunk and stuff but whatever so yeah that part is fail the wreath, just a wreath, you can't eat it. You, you, you do technically eat the wreath because you need to make Christmas cookie dough. Or right, Christmas, Christmas, it's not Christmas cookie dough, like cookie dough for Christmas. It's Christmas cookie dough, cookie dough for Christmas cookie. It's, yeah, whatever, so this, yeah, you smelt it, and then you get the Christmas cookie. You need this, it only gives you heart, it doesn't give you any effects, it's not that good. And here, here's, I like the texture. Snowman's really cute. I, I like the snowman. These each are starting to get into like what the I want the mod to be. They each give you like special effects. For some reason, water breathing, kind of snow, and water, you know. So that gives you water breathing. Christmas cooking, they say Christmas tree. Like if you regen. Because like, you know, a tree grows. And I don't know. So as it said, this where I want the, this mod to be like, you know, like this. This is what I want. Because like, you can make different foods, not just to eat, not just for like looking cool, to actually have effects for you to like be useful. And then here we go, the this guy, and he gives you really fast speed. Like I, I forget, I just like speed five or something. I forget. It's not saying, but it's because like, like the you can't catch the gingerbread man or whatever. So like, he gives you speed, you know. It's, it's, it's a funny joke, okay? Yeah. Whatever. Yeah, okay. There's probably gonna be more stuff to watch after this. That stuff's already. I don't know. It's a long story. Whatever. Go to a playing Minecraft page. Download the mod. Have fun with it. 1.8 only, not 1.8.9. Not yet. Not for like a few years. Not probably ever. But whatever. Yeah, whatever. Okay, okay, yeah. Here's the rest of the video. Okay, welcome around. I'm going to be showing off the Foods Plus mod today. And, um, so, there are two tabs. There's this tab, which has, like, some stuff. It's not really in order, but whatever. You have the Kniffy, you have the Cheater, you have all this stuff. And then you have the Breakfast, and all this stuff. And, but anyways, if you want to know the crafting recipes, you have to go to the the Planet Minecraft page. There will be like two links. There's gonna be to where you download the mod, and then a video showing how to. Yeah, I do not own the video or the mod. Those just things that would help you out because there's just so many recipes. So um, if you're gonna play. I recommend using that. Anyways. So here are some of the items. There are only two items of this that aren't edible. Yeah, the first one, it's kind of obvious which one they'd be. Which is obviously the knife. It's used for other crafting recipes. Then we have the frosting. 
It's a plate frosting. That's not that really good. But then we have the donut. Eat that. That gives you three. Not the best. But then everything is like so out of order. Then we have buns. Gives you one. Isn't that good? Then we have cheese. No. And then we have melted cheese, which only gives you half. Gives you weakness. Because it's just who eats melted cheese. Okay. But then we have grilled cheese. That's it's it's okay. Actually, it's actually pretty good. Um, we have cheeseburger. Oh, it's amazing. And then we have chocolate bar. And now we have the vitamins, which gives you strength. So if you're going to battle, you want some vitamins. And you could also eat some fiber which gives you it makes you nauseous and then makes you makes you kind of poop a little because it's fiber you know okay okay you could wear off now then there's to be wait a second player four types two equals eight okay just to point out yeah you have tomatoes tomato and you have pizza sauce well that gives you mining fatigue Oh no. But then we have the almighty beloved pizza. Oh. And it gives you instant health too. It gives you instant health too. Cause it, like T O O and T W. Yeah. Okay. And then uh, we have the breakfast. Oh, now I start starving. Okay. First we have butter. We all know you don't just don't eat butter, okay? And then we have flour. And then no, not that good. And then we have waffles, which is whoa, it's pretty good. Waffles can give you movement speed, their swiftness. And then this pancakes give you hey. So if you're gonna go on a mining trip like strip mining. You should bring pancakes because that will give you haste. And then we have artificial flavoring. If you slow this because it makes you fat. Oh. Yeah. But you, so obviously you may think artificial flavoring is useless, but of course you can use it for the creeper. Oh, it was cereal. It. But yeah, the cereal gives you jump boost. I kind of missed it, so. Creeper O's. Then you eat it. Boing, 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 boing. So yeah. And then we have scram scrambled eggs. Which, you know, doesn't really give you anything. Then we have the omelet. Which you know, first sure, wait. Okay. So I just have to double check. Omelette can give you night vision. And then, yeah. So, yeah, okay. Omelette can give you night vision. And then a tortilla. Um, doesn't really give you anything. And then we have bacon. Okay, the bacon gives you swiftness. But it's not for that much time, so. Not really that useful. Then we have breakfast burrito, which gives you fire resistance. So if you're going on another adventure, you you should bring breakfast burritos. And once I add the regular burritos, those will fire also give you fire resistance. But then we have slices of bread, gives you fire. Wait, no, it doesn't. That's just leftover from the burrito. Spread don't give you any, anything. Toast gives you night vision for a few seconds. So if you're going caving, um, might bring some toast, but it's only for a few seconds. So. Not really. I got then we have French toast which gives you regen. Which is really useful after you know eating that butter. It was really good for me. Then we have raw hash browns, which is the other item that cannot be eaten. So go down there with a the knife. And then we have regular hash browns. Doesn't give you that much food, but it gives you water breathing. So if you're going to go take on the guardian temple, you should bring hash browns. But yeah, that's all everything I've added so far. 
I'll be adding more, obviously. Okay, I'm back to Food Plus. And yes, it's a new update. With graham crackers and marshmallows and s'mores. Mm-hmm. First July update. Um, disclaimer, um, I started doing the lunch update, but then I stopped for reasons. And, um, I added one item, and it's not craftable, but it is obtainable, because it automatically puts itself in food stuffs, which is super annoying, because I put it with no creative tab, but whatever. And then there's summer holidays, which only has the s'mores. But yeah, anyways, let's get started. So we have the graham cracker, we can make that. We can make the marshmallow. And we can make the s'more. So yeah, let's go into survival and eat them all. First of all. Graham cracker, not that amazing. Oh, clear marshmallow, a little better, but not not good either. And then here is the s'more. So yeah, it gives you a decent amount of food, not the best thing ever, and gives you invisibility, and is delicious. And yeah, that's it for this update. It's a little small one, but I couldn't think of anything else to add for for it's July. That's to do with food. So yeah. Thank you, I'll see you all next update.